What's up, peoples? This is a video on how to make the notes for you version. Uh, we're going to go through step by step how to do it, how to make sure everything looks good. So let's get started. Uh, the very first thing you're going to need um, is Chrome logged into the Destiny social user. Next thing you're going to need is a set of sermon notes. And then the last thing you're going to need is the title card. You should have access to all of these things. And so uh, let's go ahead and get started. So we're going to go ahead and open up Chrome. Um, if you're not already in the social user, you can go up to people and then there should be destiny social. App dev, just kidding. Church online, Bible events, and sign in. Okay, the next thing we're going to need is some notes. So you can either get the notes emailed to you or if you have access to the tech email. We're going to be using this guy right here. And we're going to go and open up with pages because I hate Word. That's cool. <laughs> Just do it. Okay. So um, we've got Chrome. We've got Notes. And then the last thing is the title card. And if this is a sermon that's been edited recently, it's going to be in ingest and then the date and then in artwork. So here, graphics, title card. There it is. Boom. All right. So I've got the three things that I need to make this thing work. So first thing I'm going to do is create a new event. And we are going to need, name this the name of the sermon. Look at that. <laughs> Destiny Christian Church. And then the description, I use this for campus. So Phoenix, okay. Then select image. Now in here, um, this is a little bit of a smaller image than what we are used to. Uh, you don't have to use Photoshop to alter this. You can simply just go to tools and adjust size and then drop this to pixels and what do they want 1440 cool now we're going to um, save or we're going to export this as the title card you version And you can just save it to desktop. Honestly, once you re once you make it smaller, you can just delete it. Um, revert, close. Title, graphic, church, Phoenix. Location and times. Now I'm doing this on a Thursday. Uh, if you are not doing it during the service, then you can add a time as long as it's just some time in the future. And this time actually doesn't show up in the notes anywhere. So what I'm actually going to do is I'm just going to do today at 9 p.m. And it seems kind of weird. Let's do 10 p.m. Um, but the thing is, is you want to post it in the future because a good deal in the future, you don't want to just post it like 30 minutes in the future because once this goes live, you can't make any changes to it. So you want to be able to publish it and then take a look and make sure everything is good. All right. So we're going to go ahead and save that, that time, that location, and now the content. So we're going to do, um, that title card is acting as your title of the sermon. Okay. So the first thing we're going to do is this Bible reference. So let me kind of move this stuff around. I don't know what's up with that. All right. New King James.
Okay, now it's important that you understand what of this content goes into the notes. So there's really just three things. Verses, points, and then any type of um, like quote. Um, but other than that, all this other stuff does not go in there. So we're going to go ahead and do, so we're going to skip all of this, right? None of that goes in there. This is his own notes to himself. Okay, so I actually skipped this verse, and so I'm going to show you actually how to add one in after you have kind of messed it up. Um, and so in between points two and three, so if you kind of, this is two, and that's three. So I can just kind of go over here and I can say insert next, and then I can hit Bible reference. So that's a nice way without having to kind of move stuff all over the place um, that I can just go ahead and add in this Proverbs verse. Now this is kind of cool. He's got this Derek Carr clip. You know, first and foremost, I just uh, all right. So this is it. This is actually uh, the clip. To be sitting here so today, I'm just going to take this URL this and then put that in there, and then let's give it some some uh, some context here. So then, what is this? All right, cool. So number four, then we got this YouTube video, text number five. All right, so this is this this is the end of the actual like message part of it. Okay, now we do have some announcements that go at the very end. You can find those in church online right here right underneath the bible events you version verbiage super easy title content link so these are all external links so we go title content Okay, it's a previous thing. Okay, so we've got the uh, title card as kind of our top image here. It's still, uh, oh, I guess it does still have the title, Phoenix. Um, let's make sure I didn't miss anything. Second Timothy 1 9, Colossians, Ecclesiastes. I like how they have Ecclesiastes all in caps just for some random reason. No one really knows why. James 1, 7, 16, 10. Cool. Now, I believe in the app this is actually embedded. I hope it's embedded. But anyways, okay, we're done. That's it. Um, now, wherever this needs to go, they can just copy this link and um, save it, put it into the app, into the spreadsheet, which I'm just going to go ahead and do that really quick right now. Um, sorry, I did that kind of fast. So app Dev, Google Sheets, find the sermon. In your hand, this is the Phoenix version, and boom, there it is. Okay, that's it, guys. That is done deal.